But Frankie, you've had your, your, your first fight in, in your hometown, Birmingham. How was that? Yeah, it was brilliant, yeah. Uh, just all the fans all day cheering for me, calling my name out. I knew they were there for me, so I went out there to try and pay them back, and I did with a good win. What's it like fighting in front of your hometown crowd like that in such a big crowd? Uh, it's just unbelievable. When I went out there, it was a big f breath of fresh air, really, when I heard them all cheering me on, and it makes you feel really good, to be fair. So how are you looking forward to the Belfast trip and going with the other Olympians as well? Yeah, it's going to be good. I think we're going to have a good time over there. My mum and dad were born in Ireland, so it's going to be good to me. I've got a lot of family over there, so I hope that I can make the trip around to watch me box. Does this sort of travelling around uh, the country, does that suit you? Are you enjoying that? Getting to go to places that you might not have been to before? Is that... Yeah, as an amateur, we flew around the world and boxed the best from every country. So now going, I this ain't that far, really, Belfast heat, so it's nothing new, it's nothing what we haven't really done before, so... I think we're used to it and uh, hopefully we've put on a good performance for the Irish people. How's life as a pro different to life as an amateur? You could, you could, obviously, there's got to be a lot more discipline. You're doing longer rounds. And I never cheated as an amateur, but you definitely can't cheat as a professional. You've got to really live the life, and that's what I'm doing, living in Manchester and moving out of Birmingham. Tell us a bit about your, your life in Manchester. You said, obviously, you're from Birmingham, but you've moved to Manchester for training. Is that, is that why? That's why, yeah. No distractions. I just walk down the streets. No one asks me to come out or bell, nothing like that. I'm just... Staying, staying in really, I get up, go, get up in the morning, nine, have my breakfast, go to the gym at one, stay till three, go home, play computer, go on the run on the night and go to bed, it's just living the perfect boxing life. You've been a world champion at amateur level, obviously world champion at professional level is a, is a game. That, that's it really, if I didn't think that I wouldn't have turned professional, I would have just stayed amateur, well I was the number one, but I've got to go pro now and I want to be the number one at that and I'll do everything it takes to do that. Does it suit you being with Obviously, Frank and Billy and, and James as well. Yeah. Is that, does that suit you? Yeah, definitely. Frank's the best promoter in Britain, if not the world. Uh, I think he is, but some might disagree, but he's definitely the best promoter in Britain. And uh, with the other lads, we all have a good laugh, don't we? So I think it's a good atmosphere, and we're going to live in a good few years now.